So today I'm going to be showing you how to get Windows Movie Maker on your Windows 10 computer. So many of you may have noticed that with the new computers and the new laptops that you're now purchasing that have Windows 10 already pre-installed, that they no longer include a version, the free version of Windows Movie Maker, which is pretty crappy, let's say. <laughs> for all intents and purposes for those who want a free option for video editing. So what I've done is I've done some research. I checked a few couple of YouTube channels and I found a YouTube video. I'm just going to click to his channel here. And it's this Quantech guy and he did a video that's how to download Movie Maker for Windows 10. It's updated. It was just this video was just released. April 23rd, so it was literally probably just a month ago when it was released, and I found his I found his download file that he uses. It is, according to him, it is the uh, full version from Microsoft of the installation file for uh, a few essential programs that are with the 2012 edition of the Windows package. However, I, I, in this video, I don't think he kind of went into detail how to actually like get it downloaded and what to look for and stuff. So I kind of wanted to walk this, walk you through this step by step in case anybody is interested in giving this a shot and be able to get Windows Movie Maker for free on your computer. So what I am done right now is I'm in an incognito window. That is totally optional for you. It's just for me, for recording purposes, I didn't want to have all my window tabs open on my browser. So I'm using Chrome, by the way, if anybody um, was wondering, I use Chrome for my browser. So I'm going to copy and paste the link and it is hosted on Mediafire, which is a, a hosting service for files. And you can see that the file that you're looking for is the wlsetup-all.exe file. Okay, so once we click on that, the link, you'll see you'll come up with this media fire with a whole bunch of ads and all this stuff. Whenever you're doing something with a site like this, you want to be careful that you're not actually clicking on any ads. Um, it is nice to have a pop-up blocker installed, but I'm showing you this because this incognito window has no pop-up blocker. So I'm going to show you exactly what you want to look for. You're going to click, this is the WL setup, you're going to click this green button, not this one, this is an ad. Okay, this is an ad. You can look at these sites and actually tell what are ads. Right here, you're going to click the download button. All right. Now, what happens is you see how there's a pop-up ad here, right? What we're going to do, updates recommended, we don't give a crap about that. We're going to just click X to get out of that window. Just hit leave. You do not even want to open that. It already has been downloaded here, and it's downloading the file. You don't want to download anything else except for this one that says WL Setup ALL, and it should be installed in a few seconds. There we go, and it's installed. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to just double click on this so that we can install it, and I'll show you exactly what comes up next. Um, that comes up that says, do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device? I'm going to click yes. This is the window that shows up. So what we want to do is we want to choose, choose, we want to choose the second option, choose the programs you want to install because we don't need to install them all. If it prompts you with a first, uh, a first window to that you're missing some type of a, um, a net pack or some type of extra software because it might not be on your Windows 10, go ahead and install that. That is Windows just making sure that it has everything that it needs to be able to run the software. So we're going to hit choose programs you want to install. We're going to de-click Messenger. We're going to de-click Mail. We're going to de-click Writer. We only want Photo Gallery and Movie Maker. That's the only thing. Photo Gallery and Movie Maker come hand in hand. So we're just going to make sure that's clicked and we're going to hit install and it's going to go ahead and install. Like I said, I wanted to, I wanted you guys to see this first and foremost exactly how to get this installed on your phone on your computer. And if you if you don't if you don't trust the the file, you can always do a scan, you can always do a virus scan on it first before you actually install it. As soon as it's done, it says Windows Essentials is installed. To use it, click close. We're going to hit click close. And then you should be able to see Movie Maker should show up in your start menu. Double click on it. 
you're going to, when you double click on the Movie Maker icon, you're going to click Accept. And there you have it. We have Windows Movie Maker on a Windows 10 computer. And this is a free editing software that you can use. And you can probably find a ton of videos on the internet how to edit inside of Movie Maker. So if you like these kind of videos, please make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. And if you have any questions or you have any more recommendations or any suggestions on future videos that you would like to see from me, please make sure you leave them in the comments below. I hope you guys will come back for my next video. Bye guys.